I was asked, what is the most I have made wealthy? And what is the least I have made wealthy? Well, the least I have made wealthy was $8 an hour. 2006, I got out of prison. I was in a town called Newport, Arkansas. And I got hired at a, uh, at a facility that actually well fabricated and installed called TaylorMade. It started off at $8 an hour. Now, in 30 days of me being there, or maybe a little less than 30 days, I got a raise from $8 to $10. Now, I only was making this look amount of money because of, look at me, my color, and me being a felon and just getting out of prison and that was fine with me. I'm like, hey, I just need someone to give me an opportunity. And they did that. My next job, I went up and I went up. So, how much have I made an hour welding? I done made up to the most I had made. It's around, I'm gonna say $100 clear. But I did a project that took me four hours to do. No, it took me two hours to do and I made $400. So that's pretty much like $200 an hour, but that wasn't like on something that I do all the time. But I had made $100 consistently and I had made 65 consistently and 50 consistently being independent. Now, as far as working for somebody, I had went from, like I say, $8 and the most I had made punching a clock it's $27 an hour. That's the most I had made. And that was being a field uh, foreman welder installer. I am working pretty much. I did everything. I just traveled and did different jobs. But that's the most I had made. Punching the clock is $27 an hour. <clears throat> so I went from $8 to $27 punching the clock with my trade of welding. And that's why I say welding is very uh, valuable and do different things and the money you can make is unreal. It's all about your mentality and what you're willing to do and how you're willing to sacrifice and how you spend your money and what you actually want to do. You know, I know when you first jump into it, you just want to get some money, enjoy life, buy some things you ain't never had and then they get old and you're like, man, you know, I'm on something else now. That's life. But as for me, I will most definitely say I have gained my independence through welding, fabricating, installation, iron, all that.